These images that uh, will go around the world of tourists in panic and being killed in Tunisia have two purposes for ISIL. One is to once again instill fear in the West to make it seem that you know, we cannot, we in the West cannot do what we want because we are under threat from ISIL. The other is much simpler, I think it's to do with Tunisia itself, which is that Tunisia is being held up as a success story for democracy where moderate Islam and uh, secular parties can coexist within a democratic framework. That is the case in the Tunisian government. Uh, but Tunisia is heavily reliant on tourism for foreign exchange earnings, so they want to damage that industry to damage uh, this model. Um, and uh, secular parties can coexist within a democratic framework. That is the case in the Tunisian government. Have two purposes for ISIL. One is to once again instill fear in the West to make it seem that to do with Tunisia itself, which is that Tunisia is being held up as a success story for democracy, where moderate Islam, you know, we cannot, we in the West cannot do what we want because we are under threat from ISIL. The other is much simpler, I think it's to these images that uh, will go around the world of tourists in panic and being killed in Tunisia 